Two of the most powerful, useful, interesting, popular these custom rooms are available for some of or maybe a lot of devices. We have Dub Fest OS, we have Evolution XOS. Both of these custom rooms have insane number of customizations, good UI, and a lot more things. First of all, let me tell you that both of these builds are the latest ones. Both of the ones have Android 12 L running, which means we have the main security patch, the latest update. So as all these features which I'm showing you are available in this May security patch patch update so if something is not available in your update make sure to check out if you're using this update version which i'm using here first of all if i move on to the default launcher settings evolution x is basically a pixel ui with customizations and bit of extra stuff but of is is not actually pixel ui it will give you some extra things for example the default launcher is the derp launcher which includes a bit of customizations for you like icon pack customizations icon size home screen app drawer miscellaneous etc you can do you can do all these things with evolution x pixel launcher also but with some modifications you need to root your device you need to install pixel modes or you need to install some magisk modules for that but all these things are by default available in dubfest os but i'm not comparing that one room is best or one room is not both of these rooms are actually quite good but i'm just saying with you i'm just talking about some differences which you have in these ones so stay tuned other than else, if I move on to the quick settings panel, as Evolution X OS in Android 12 L or Android 12.1, we have the black background in quick settings panel, while in Dubfest OS, we have the white background. But one major, one minor thing, if you're able to notice, some animations. In my personal opinion, I think so Dubfest OS is not good in these kind of things. Evolution X is far better even they give you the black background, but animations should be there. Dubfest OS has no animations like the Evolution X OS or Android 12.1, so kind of a disappointment, but it's not a big deal. If I move on to the customization section, if I move the miscellaneous options, in both of the miscellaneous things, you can see some differences. For example, in Dubfest OS, you have the Dubfest logo and data disabled icon, bit of extra things. But if I move on to the Evolution XOS, you have the hide apps option available, which is quite useful. As in Pixel Launch, you don't have these support. And this is something really interesting. Allow application downgrade and ignore Windows secure flags. I have a dedicated specific video on both of these versions. So I will provide you the link for both of the specific videos so that you can check out the full video if you want to. In this video, I can't cover all these topics, but you can see in miscellaneous in Evolution XOS, you have unlimited Google photo storage and a lot more things. While in uh, in Dubfest OS, you only have the unlimited Google photo storage. So no major useful things available in Dubfest OS, unfortunately. But in customizations, I think Dubfest OS has better ones if I compare to the Evolution XOS. In the terms of feature-based room, I will recommend you to use a Dubfest if I compared these two. But if I recommend you for the customizations things, you can simply choose Dubfest OS. If I move to features or useful features, you will see Evolution XOS. Sorry for that. But yes, Evolution x is good in the terms of features Dubfest OS is good in the terms of ui but overall both of these custom rooms are good enough to use on a device as a daily driver if you want to and yes you can install both if you want to it's up to you link is already available in the description including the full video if you want to take a look at the Dubfest OS review or if you want to take a look at the evolution x review this is also from today's short and simple video i will see you in the next video make sure to like the subscribe the channel goodbye Over the edge, feel like I'm floating through